Hello everyone. So today is Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Thanks, Bubs. Today's a Wednesday, and I am um, up in my room, and I'm probably gonna go to sleep. Not go to, like not You're right. Smallville. I'm gonna watch Smallville. Bubs knows me better than I know myself, apparently. Anyway, so the reason why I turn um, on the camera is to show you that my skin has not been pretty well. It's not been doing all that You're well. Be, be quiet, bubs. Yeah, so I just want to let you know, so it's not always rainbows and butterflies with skin. Even though you get treatment and you use the right products, there are some days when your skin's going to be really bad. So just wanted to share that with you, that if you are going through that, hang in there. And yeah, um, everybody gets bad skin once in a while, at least I'd like to think that. And unless, of course, you're blessed with really amazing skin, then good on you. Bad skin at least once a month. And we all know why. Um, so we have what well, I like to use most of the time if I do. I use the Seabury Moisturizing Face Oil. And if I get a breakout, I would use the Aeronomicin Gel, which I have talked about multiple times. And also, I really like using this, which is the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate. Now, I'm not sure what I'm going to use tonight. Probably this and uh, this as well. I need to buy more of this because this is amazing. And this is the Kiehl's Clearly Corrective Spot Treatment. Yeah, so that was skin update. If you think somebody's skin is perfect, it probably isn't because nobody's skin is perfect. Unless you're a baby or you're just blessed with it. Anyway, I also wanted to show you that I bought this um, Becca After Glow Palette. And I actually bought this from a page called... Glam it up and I love the service of this page. The lady was just so sweet, so nice, and she was really helpful and I really enjoyed the service that I got. It looks like I'll show you what it looks it like. It fits me better. Oh yeah, it looks better on Bubs' skin than mine. You could actually still see the glitter on it. You can still see it on mine as well. But mine's more visible. Bubs has better skin than mine? Yep. That's great. Bubs, give me a wrist five. I mean an yeah, there we go. It's not wrist, elbow five. <laughs> get your body parts correct. Sorry, bubs. Okay, so this is what the palette looks like. Um, it has uh, five, what are these, highlighter shades. And I really like all of them. So it um, has, oh, almost dropped it there. There we go. We've got Moonstone, we've got Rose Gold, Topaz, Wild Honey, and Flower Child. So that's that. I love the rose gold packaging and I cannot wait to use this and put this on my face. Lit <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I was so scared. <laughs> and I'm just gonna go and wash my face. I will show you what I will wash my face with because I want you to see the skin Dude, care. Don't make it with my Shut up. Anyway, so I am using... Where is it? I took a shower. I am using the Bioderma cleanser and this is a really really nice cleanser so if you have um, sensitive skin then I would really recommend that to you and what else do I want to use I don't want to use too much on my skin because it's already uh, break like not breaking out but it's kind of like in that phase which is not really the healthiest phase so I don't want to use too much I want to keep it as minimal as possible like not experiment so I'm just going to use that and maybe the Kiehl's uh, midnight recovery concentrate and pop the erinomycin gel on this uh, the lighter that we have and I call this this was Harvey so Harvey left and now we have Ben so this is Ben so yeah I'm gonna put the erinomycin gel on Ben and I will then catch you later hello everyone today is a Saturday and I am vlogging and that's great because I'm vlogging after so long uh, so yeah, we're going out and I really like the song, but let me just pause it because yeah, there we go. So I'm ready. I'll show you my outfit. So I'm wearing finally the shirt that I bought from H&M and this is just a cold shoulder top, which I really, really, really like. And then I'm wearing my black cardi jeans, which I absolutely love these days. And then I am wearing my shoes that I got from Outfitters really like them and I have uh, this on my lips this is the Colourpop Cosmetics in Limbo and I really like the colour but just on its own it's really really dark so I had to tone it down a bit 
upper lip sweat problems. Um, yeah, and um, the reason why I picked up the camera is because I wanted to show you that after ages, I used the Sleek Blush by 3 palette and this is a cream blush palette. I used to use this palette so much back in the day, but then I started collecting so many blushes, I kind of forgot that I had this. And I used this one today and I've kind of not enjoyed using cream blushes for a while, but... Um, yeah, today I really did. And also, um, I think the last clip was me showing you my skin, uh, that I was having a couple of rough days. Well, my skin has kind of settled down and I feel like um, I can't really show you properly because obviously I'm wearing makeup. And I do have a tiny blighter here, which is kind of dying, kind of not dying, but it's in the process. So yeah, I wanted to show you that I use the Revlon Color Stay Foundation and this is a great foundation covering acne so if you have like acne problems scarring problems then i think this is a great great foundation and i like to bring this out when i don't have a really nice skin day so i feel like this one in particular has been my absolute favorite for for a while and yeah that's it what i wanted to show you i will catch you um later takes you home Here we go. one more time <laughs> I take the camera and Samreen's like all quiet. <laughs> it happens every time you What are we doing, Samreen? What are we doing? We're watching a horror movie. Horror Which one are we? Movie What's, the password? Lots of What's the password? 8957. 8957. E. Now, anyone passing by and probably they've seen this vlog, they'll know your password. <gasps> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Here's the USB. First, we're gonna watch the trailer, aren't we? Oh yeah, we're watching yeah. the trailer. So basically, no, it says your password is incorrect. No, that's not true. So basically, Eight, nine, we're at some green space. We just seven. had pizza, and now we're like stuffed one, out one, of our skin. And now we're gonna watch a really scary okay. movie. We were contemplating watching Seven or a scary okay. movie, and now we're like we're gonna watch a scary movie. So we're gonna we're gonna do that. But first, we're watching the trailer so that yes, we, we know are. what the movie is about because apparently we have no idea what the movie is about. Better be it better be scary because I'm like I'm I'm ready to be scared. I'm in the mood for like a scary movie. It's Same. been so long since I've watched a scary movie. Same. I get so awkward every time. Hello everyone, I am back home and it's currently pretty late. And my eyes hurt because I'm wearing contacts. I really need to take them off. So yeah, I didn't vlog more because we started watching the movie and we ended up watching um Dark Skies and it's a really nice movie like for a scary movie I really liked it because it wasn't like about possession and exorcism and stuff it was very different so I liked it but I just didn't like the ending because they left it on a cliffhanger I'm not gonna give too much of it away because if you end up watching the movie then I want it to be a surprise for you and if you do because it's a really good movie and I do recommend it yeah and um it's really really hot I was really like, I when I went there, I was like, why oh, did I wear jeans? Because it's so freaking hot and these jeans are pretty thick. These are the ones that I got from Mango. And I literally regretted wearing jeans because it's so freaking hot. And now I cannot wait to take them off and get rid of them and wash my face and jump into bed. I'll catch you later. A little someone I know might be turning 22 tomorrow. Is it Maybe you? Maybe it's you! Is it me? Oh, it Am is! Are you turning 22? Or maybe 23! You promised to sing me a song. You promised. The song. You have to sing it. Sure, show me the lyrics. Okay, now. I don't know about you. I'm feeling 22. You don't know about me. home from the perfume launch and before I washed my face and before I forgot I wanted to talk about um, I wanted to talk about it more because I feel like I didn't really actually properly start talking about it also look at my balance it's like lopsided anyway um, also if I look slightly weird in some areas of my face it's because I'm literally melting because it's so hot and I can't believe my foundation is still on because literally it's it's so hot but i just want to talk about the perfume launch for a little bit great i met some really nice bloggers and um 
some of the people have even started YouTube and yeah so I will leave the links to them down below if you want to check them out you can like google them or whatever um, so the perfume launch uh, lately there's this um, a lady entrepreneur coming in from the UK and she was launching some perfumes she's already launched them in the UK and she was so so sweet and I loved her PA her name was Sunera but she's so sweet so if you're watching this Sunera hi I already launched her perfumes uh, in South Africa and in the Middle East, I think it was Doha and she's come here to Pakistan She wants to launch her perfumes here as well And so we got a couple of samples and yeah, so today was just like the briefing kind of a meet and greet thing Where she talked about her perfumes and she'd like tell a little bit about her perfumes and she was so 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 sweet so the perfumes are basically um the, the underlining thing what I like understood was oud so oud is kind of like an oil which you extract from trees and it's like really heavily scented these are her five scents um, so this is the oud this is like the signature one and then she has iram which is another this one's my favorite I love this one and this one is like a bestseller so if, if you guys live in the UK then you should like definitely go somewhere and check these out like maybe search her online I'll leave her links down as well and yeah, so basically there are five perfumes in all and they smell really really good guys like I'm not joking They smell really amazing and I'm so excited for them to come out. The packaging is amazing. I filmed that I will um, You will see that in a later clip and yeah, they're really nice I really like them and I'm sweating like anything right now because it's so freaking hot really in oh How is my makeup still on? <laughs> Props to this foundation because it's still on so I quickly want to mention this guys, I got sent this from Luscious, Luscious Cosmetics and I've been so obsessed with these brushes, this is like a whole pack and I've wanted this for so long, I've never really bought it, I don't know why and I finally have it now and I just gotta stop using it, like all those brushes, I'm not using them, I'm just using this. And this is so nice to travel with, I love that it just rolls up like that and you can just, I mean how, how cool is that? So thank you so much Luscious and I will leave the link to this down below because guys you need to check this out This is super inexpensive. This is this was like 2k or something which is amazing You get like so many brushes and you get a whole case and amazing quality brushes and I really like them and I gotta wash my face because my makeup is like melting off now and you will be able to see the clip to the event right now Guys, I'm currently at a perfume event launch thing So, uh oh yeah, so this is what it is. So we get some samples. Um, this is what it looks like. It hasn't started yet properly, but hopefully when it will, I will update you. And it's really, really hot right now. I'm like melting. It's probably 45 degrees outside. And I initially wasn't going to open my hair, but, you know, I just did. Um, anyway, I'm post it. So I've made a new friend. Hi. What's your favorite scent? Oh, this is Xenia, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think it's this one. Which what's the name? It says Royal Mira. Mine's this one. Um Iram. This one's my favorite one. It smells really, really good. I know. I just smelled it. It's really good. It's one of my faves. <laughs> I will, I'll come to you at the end. <laughs> Hello. Do you want to introduce yourself? I am Aja and I'm Yeah. I'll leave your link. I'll leave everyone's links. Okay. Hello. Hi, I'm Jadira Sarma and I blog over at Jessie Cassie's website. Awesome. Hi, I'm Aliha. Do you want to introduce yourself? <laughs> no, introduction. no introduction needed? No, no. I'm Maliha Rao from redlsrao.com yeah. and uh, I'm here checking out the foods that they have to offer Yeah. and I think I'm not going to give any to my Yeah, mom. which one was your favorite? You never told me. I like Iram. Yeah, I like Iram as well. That's my favorite. Hello. Hi. How are you? Yeah. This is what the bottles look like. How pretty are they? I really like how they look. Yep, I would buy this. This journey about three years ago. That's when I came up and I decided and told my dad that we got a baking of perfume. That was strange because they meant that it's okay. It's either like a perfume or food or just a really expensive oil. 
spends a lot of money. Maybe if I start making it, she'll stop wearing mine. Guys, it's time for food. You want some food? Yes, I would like a samosa. Thank you. And yeah. But I think I lost that one. Somebody borrowed it from me and they never gave it back. So basically, uh, debt collection problems. So yeah, this is We Can't Wait graduation summer. This was the first one. I really enjoyed that one.